inside the house right now and literally we can't breathe. That's the view from the window and I can't keep it open. That's the view from the balcony. Hello everyone, it's around 4 p.m. here in Gaza. The situation is just getting worse. Here are pictures and memories of people we don't know anything about. I hope they're doing well. Okay, during wait times, all the neighbors they just keep their door open so you can just enter your neighbor's house. It's okay. For my neighbors, they didn't evacuate as well, they have their windows down. Here are their windows and here is the family they're gathering all together also in a place far away from the window i was trying to explain things but i think you can hear them now I'll go check on my parents. صراحة I can't imagine like the aftermath, like if this war was ever over, if there was ever still Gaza, if I was alive, like I can't imagine the aftermath. Look at the streets. Can you imagine that I lived my whole life here in Gaza and I can't even recognize the streets right now? Can you imagine that it's becoming a regular scene? We're just walking Gaza and the buildings that are demolished everywhere. everyone it's around 4 p.m here in gaza the situation is just getting worse there are literally no words to describe what's happening no electricity no water no internet like almost 90 percent of gaza they don't have connection we can't even call each other uh, there is no internet as i previously said like i literally have a little bit a little a little little bit of internet like i went out today i went to honor schools i took uh, pictures and videos i played with the kids and so on but there is no like the internet is barely working as i said so i didn't post anything yet at any minute like whole Ga maybe like all of gaza won't have any electricity or any water or anything like the situation just feels so unreal i hope that will be the last update i post i'm trying my best to keep the world updated but like that's all what I can do with the given the situation the circumstances the internet the electricity also there is barely media coverage because it's not safe and because of how destroyed and demolished the streets are like journalists Palestinian civil defense uh, ambulance they can't reach to areas like we went today me and the other journalists we tried to cover a certain area but like the car it can't enter inside anything uh, may bomb at any minute so it's really difficult people are literally evacuating in bicycles they don't have cars they don't have anything he's just walking with his bicycle For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today Newsmo.